right now, there are platforms where you can go and literally apply and get jobs tomorrow. I think Design Hill is actually one of those. Um, plenty of other platforms that you can go and check out where you can get work very quickly and easily. I think for a lot of people that are concerned about the future economy, recognize this. We've not just gone to remote work, we've gone to digitizing the economy. So anything that is digital is going to now grow. My name is Liam Martin. I am a human being located on planet Earth. More specifically, I am located in Canada. I'm currently at my COVID bunker that I've been at for the last six months, trying to make sure that I stay safe during the pandemic. But I also have a few tech companies that I've co-founded and organized. Uh, TimeDoctor.com, which is a time tracking tool for remote teams. Staff.com, which is an analytics tool for remote work and running remote which is the largest conference on building and scaling remote teams. So for those of you that didn't know, I am really passionate about remote work and trying to figure out how those organizations grow and scale over time. I just had my first daughter. She is one month old and it has been a really interesting experience trying to figure out how to adapt to being a parent inside of the work from home type of environment that we've created for ourselves. I actually think right now we are dealing with a, we're dealing with a, a you know, a uh, health crisis, which is not just the pandemic, it is also a mental health crisis. I think that there are a lot of people right now that are very concerned, very scared, uh, number one of the virus, secondarily about their the economy, uh, are they going to be able to put food on the table for their family? And I know for me, this is something that we've in, even experienced internally in our companies where we've had people that have had to take a week off or have had to meet with our company psychologist um, or our our life coaches to be able to make sure that they're locked in and they know what they are trying to right now there are platforms where you can go and literally apply and get jobs tomorrow i think design hill is actually one of those um, plenty of other platforms that you can go and check out where you can get work very quickly and easily i think for a lot of people that are concerned about the future economy recognize this We've not just gone to remote work, we've gone to digitizing the economy. So anything that is digital is going to now grow and it's almost definitive, it's at escape velocity at this point. And anything that isn't is unfortunately going to contract. So it's really important that everyone recognize that and then start to realign your personal skill set towards that digitization of the economy. In terms of work, the the biggest challenge that we have right now, honestly, is talent acquisition. So post-COVID, we saw a huge influx of people that wanted to work remotely. But that actually, you'd think that that's a positive, but in reality, actually, it just overloads the HR team because they have to go through not just 100 applicants, but 500, 600, 700 applicants for a particular job spec. In the last three months, we've hired at least, I mean, we hire, we hire a dozen or more people a month and we want to hire like two dozen people a month. So that's been our biggest challenge right now is just getting our heads around how we can grow effectively to be able to make sure that everything is, um, is pumping. The reality is, is that you may see remote work as a hindrance, but in reality, actually, it's a massive asset. This is the largest shift in labor since the Industrial Revolution. We, are, we have completely reorganized our economy to go from a place that you go from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m., Monday to Friday, to an environment in which 
you can work very freely, right? You can interact with work the way that you want to work with it. We've known it for years. That's been our advantage in the market where we're able to really kind of grow 30% faster because we're not paying for offices and computer equipment and all these other things that, that basically drag down the growth of a tech startup. Now, if you're just starting your business or if you have an on-premise business and you've been forced into a remote work agreement, this is the opportunity for you to be able to get that same type of advantage. And I actually only think it's going to last for fundamentally probably the next six to 18 months before everyone else understands this. Most of the large tech companies now have either said we're allowing remote work or we are completely going remote which is incredibly exciting. And those are the companies that I would personally invest in um, over the next 24 months because they will have a 30% faster growth rate, all things being equal. Thank you viewers for watching Entrepreneurial Spirit by Design Hill. Best place to find me is youtube.com slash running remote. All of our talks are up there for free. And then I also do weekly videos on building and scaling remote teams.